about to get some brekkie. That's what they call it here. Look at that. And it's raining. Okay, I'm just gonna say the one time we get to explore the city, it rains. I know of this really amazing breakfast spot that I wanna take you guys, I wanna show you. So if you're ever in Bondi, you guys know exactly where to eat. So let's go. There's the hottest waiters here. <laughs> so all the single really ladies. <laughs> I want to name my girl, hopefully I have a girl, a boy name. I like Jordan. Jordan's cool. Jordan's unisex, right? Yeah. No. Oh, shit. <laughs> I, thought, I thought a bird shed on you for a second. I was on a date one time and a bird shit on me. You know it because it shit on me in the back. Like it shit down my, my back. And then I was like on my date. He was like, oh my <laughs> god. I was like, what? And he's like, wait, wait, turn around, turn around. And I was like, I was, I was like, wait, why? Like, what are you and there's shit all down my back. That's actually like good luck, apparently. It the is. The bird shits on your shoulder. It's good luck. It is. brisket omelet with um, heaven in the middle. I don't know what it is, but it smells so good. <laughs> like their like super, super popular dish, which is like a, what is that, a pea pancake? I don't know. This is one of their breaky bowls. It has no meat, just an egg, some um, greens, phyllo, got One panda. Okay. That's so Jersey. Yeah, it looks that like is. a Taylor ham sandwich. It looks like a Taylor ham sandwich from New Jersey. <laughs> the Jersey. <laughs> Cool is that? 
you have to have a membership to swim in the pool, but it's still cool to check out and see and take pictures by. It's definitely a landmark here in Bondi. So say hi to the food dude. <laughs> So that was my friend Max, who is Max, I think his Instagram is Max the Body, but he lives in California, we're sort of neighbors, so it's kind of cool to see him. <laughs> Fighting like a married couple. He hates being in video. We got into a huge fight and almost broke up our our friend <laughs> slash relationship. <laughs> friend slash relationship. Our film relationship. Wow, you guys. Look at all of our Bring it in. Bring it in on team on three. One, two, three. Team. Ew, what are you doing? <laughs> That's why he's single. <laughs> <laughs> I just came all over your chocolate. <laughs> we should probably go. This is a pretty amazing day. I'm not gonna lie. You guys have to end your Bondi day with ice cream out of a van. <laughs> what? Oh <laughs> oh. Are you saving that for later? Mm -hmm. We are in the back of an Uber. <laughs> My upper lip smells like chocolate. Chocolate. <laughs> She's asked me three times in this car ride if she smells like chocolate. Chocolate. I'm insecure. <laughs> right? I got a face full of chocolate and flaky nuts. <laughs> so we took an Uber from Bondi to Sydney, which was about 20 minutes. So it was a pretty quick trip. And now we're gonna go see the Opera House. What else? The, the bridge. The Harbor Bridge and maybe the zoo. Maybe the zoo. We're gonna try to see what we can do in the amount of time we have today. So we're in Circular Key right now. What she said. This is basically the area where all the ferries are. So behind us is a ferry. Come on. <laughs> this way, there's ferries up there. Called wharfs, actually. Wharfs. Are you sure? Wharf. <laughs> They're called wharfs. So each wharf, you hop on and take it to like a different island or. So where do, where do these go? So wharf five takes you to Manly Beach, I believe, which is like a beach here that's like really pretty. Ooh. And then Manly, it's really manly. <laughs> and then wharf four, which is where we're gonna go, is gonna take us to the zoo. And then Wharf 2 takes you to Watson's Bay. I might be wrong. Look it up. Don't take my word on it. Yeah, don't watch this <laughs> vlog and then get on to thinking you're going to go somewhere and then you end up somewhere else. Yeah, it's cool. So you can basically go anywhere you want off these different ferries. And they're like 10 to 20 minute boat rides. And it's super cool. So check it out. Check it out. called the Opera Bar. It's really cool because you're right beside the Opera House and you can eat and drink down here, sit along the water, which is really awesome. So this is definitely something to put on your to-do list when you're here.
opera house. <laughs> Got a creeper in the background. <laughs> is this place so cool? So we were trying to figure out why this place is so popular, and apparently it won a design award in like 1950. Yep. Um, also, apparently there's many venues inside of the opera house. So it's actually five venues inside, not just five one. performing arts centers inside of the whole establishment. And they still do opera here, which is awesome. We should have yeah. went to an opera show. Yeah, we probably would have fell asleep. And then, right over here in this grassy area, <laughs> is the botanical gardens. So we're just gonna hop on over there. Darling Harbor. <laughs> the Darling Harbor. <laughs> Here, there's tons of restaurants, there's museums, there's the aquarium, there's a zoo. There's so much to do in this space. This is what it looks like. And so we're gonna show you guys really quick um, what there is to do. Rocking back and forth, and the wind just blows you away. What? <laughs> 